Hi everyone, it's me Katya. I'm back and here I am with another member of my crew. She is Trinka, which can be translated, mostly translated with the Boozer in English, I think. And she is my cheapest and yet uh, one of my dearest uh, BJD because uh, I do live action role play and she was uh, uh, the first, no, the second uh, character I had, uh, I played in uh, live action role play and her real name is Alberto Berto calling Dr. Marion Dr. the Marjorie and uh, she is uh, the son of a very famous pirate but she's uh, she is not so famous yet not so talented. She is mostly a boozer and um, she wears the his father's cupboard but she can use it. And she's calling herself a captain even if uh, her crew uh, doesn't see her as a captain but as a Dex Whopper when she's not thrown over the <laughs> in in the sea and uh, she's wear she's basically basically wearing what I was wearing uh, in the action role play except for the for the hat that has a charm it is basically a hairpin it was made from Kalikori Kami a uh, good friend of mine uh, that uh, does uh, human sized uh, props and it was a human sized prop that sh that I bought for above from her and uh, I love it. Uh, she's basically wearing a lot of human sized props for example. This cupboard is a uh, paper cutter from uh, um, a medieval museum uh, that uh, is very near to my house. It's called the uh, Stibert Museum. It's awesome. If you can uh, visit Italy, please visit uh, uh, the Stibert Museum because it's full of medieval armors and uh, swords. Uh, it's amazing. And this corset, uh, leather corset, is in reality um, a leather bracelet, a man leather bracelet, and uh, it's perfect for a uh, size because uh, it seems like uh, um, it looks like uh, a very good uh, underbust. Um, I made those um, pants. They are not leggings, they are harem pants, I think. They are made from uh, an old pair of uh, iron pants I used to wear while live action were playing. And so this has, <laughs> they have a very emotional bonding. I have a very emotional bonding with them. Uh, she has uh, little scar charms uh, on the sides of these iron pants because I thought that uh, pirates have to have some skulls somewhere. I bought these beautiful um, stockings from Aliexpress, I think, uh, and uh, even the boots came from Aliexpress. They are pre pretty in black shape, and they came like that, but I don't mind it. I mean, uh, she's a pirate, she's supposed to have bad uh, shaped uh, boots, so I think it's great. Uh, I put her some black gloves because I um, I put on uh, some resin sole jointed ends on her and unfortunately they are tan, they mirrored all tan and the resin sole tan doesn't match at all. She is um, a mirrored all Mika in uh, sunburn skin and uh, her makeup uh, is um, a custom makeup from Mirador. 
uh, she's missing a mole. I asked for a mole, but they didn't put it. So I think uh, I will ask a fellow friend, <laughs> a good friend of mine, uh, to put a mole on her. I refuse to do face up anymore, as I said in the other video, because I can do it. Uh, Mr. Superclear hates me and <laughs> usually became all white, so, <laughs> so I don't do makeup anymore. Um, these belts uh, are actually this one and this one. Uh, uh, are male bracelets that I take from Amazon with Amazon Prime so they are pretty cheap and pretty cute and um, that's it she is uh, amazing uh, she can't stand uh, on her own very well because of due to the heels shoes and due to the fact that uh, I hate mirrored legs and arms I mean uh, they are so difficult to pose and I don't know if uh, I I restring it too tight or too loose I can figure it. <laughs> so probably it's uh, my problem because I see uh, a lot of fellow collector that can stand uh, this body so amazingly, but I can do it. Sorry, my cat is destroying the environment. And that's it for today because my cat is trying to kill me. <laughs> Okay, bye-bye, see you soon.